Hello guys, welcome back to another reptile video. Today's reptile review is going to be me showing you my um, reptiles of this month because I've got rid of some of them and I've changed stuff around. But today we're going to start with my um, corn snake. I believe this is a um, female corn snake. I've took a hide off her so you can um, you guys can see the colours of her. Um, she's recently just shed what I've got above her vivarium um, as well and she, she's doing pretty well around here um, you probably can't see her face because it's probably on many there at the moment there it is well that's her and I'll probably get her out at the end of this video so you can see her and other things so that's my corn snake Come over here, and you'll see um, Mary, and she's got a new female in with her, which is Ruby. Um, I only put these two together because they are wondering what was in here that you would have seen in my last reptile room video. Um, I am selling, and she is downstairs. So that's her with her um, being a red bearded dragon I thought she's quite cool so I'll probably keep hold of her for quite long um there's Ruby not Ruby um Mary my first bearded dragon I ever got I'm keeping hold of her as well she's a bit different to everybody else she's got um nibbled tail and some toes you can see over there that's them too so they're, they're two doing fine and up here we have got my two sand geckos Male and a female. Um, you probably see back. Oop. Open this up. You see back there, in this corner there. That um, there's a sand gecko. Probably, probably gonna come up there. You can probably just see it. There. Probably hiding, but I'm not gonna disturb as much because you can see that um, there's four eggs back there. One down there. And also one over there, so I don't really want to um, disturb him or her. But I've got two. You can probably see if I lift this up, there's one of me here as well. Um, nope. They must be both. They must be both hidden behind there then, except if they're um down one of the corners of the varium down here. I'll have a check. Um, oh yeah, there's one. Over here, I'm gonna get two of it being very quiet. There's one that is the um female, I believe, because she is now pregnant again. And yeah, that's my sun geckos. So over there is the male in the corner. Then, so if you pull that up, come down to here, this is my. Male bearded dragon. Wonder why he's black and stuff. That's just his shed. Um, I put him in this vivarium because I thought it'd be more easier, be more practical, and um, he likes it. You just got normal setup as what um, this, this used to be Ruby's setup. So I just changed them to around. Yeah. That's him. Got his little dish and stuff. Have to clean the glass. So I just wanted to um, take a minute and just show you guys these. This is why I feed them. This is the first time. I'm um, just the first time I'll be trying these kind of ones in the box. As you can see, there's like I've got four um. 72 of them in there and you just keep them in the box this is what I feed all my beardies just keep them in the box and yeah so what I'm going to do now like what I said to you at the start of this video is that I'm going to get my snake out so that you guys can see it a bit more um 
and let's hope it doesn't try and strike me as probably not going to but it does like hiding at the back of the vivarium it's a bit angry at the moment I don't know why probably I just took it out to hide um comes across through here I'll get it I'll get it now actually no well hmm quite difficult how she's feeling that she's under threat at the moment um, you see a little face there. <laughs> if I just get something, what does normally um intimidate her from coming out? Right. So if I just somehow put this glove on, without getting it's stressed and stuff. So this glove normally makes her a bit, a bit more calmer than she normally is. I'll get her out and I'll show you then. Well, I don't. This is pretty. This is a experiment for me, pretty much. When I started reptiles, because I said to myself, I'll never get a snake. And one day, I decided that I've seen a lot of snakes on gum tree, <clears throat> baby ones. This, this is not her, she's not fully um, full size yet, so she's probably going to attack me as I try and went, go for her. I'll do a feeding video. Um, tomorrow when I feed them I fed them all today as well but she's probably not gonna go for me I'll move these wood out of the way it's a bit longer video than I normally do because I want to get this out and show you here we go come here So yeah guys, this is my corn snake. Um, I think it's a female. If anybody can tell me differently, that this will probably be a male. But I've seen like pictures of males being more darker than females. <laughs> so yeah that's my corn snake out and about um only i've only kept this glove on so that be a pain probably trying to take it off and stuff but yeah thank you guys for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video bye